Hello, in the previous video I told you that I made my own custom calendar sheet for my Roll20 games. Uh, now, as brief and to the point as possible, I'm going to show you how to do it. Uh, but first, a pro account is required. Okay, let's start. Okay, step number one, go to custom sheet sandbox and create a new game. Let's put test two, create new game. And then let's launch this game. Okay, then you open a text editor. In this case, I'm using uh, Notepad++ and you have to use this tag. Let's see, it could be any kind of input, but for this example, I'm just going to use text. And This book strength and slash there. And let's put here string and save it. Save. So I'm saving it here as example two HTML. Then we have to open it with this button here in the sheet sandbox tools the HTML button. Okay, here example two, open. Okay, then we create a character sheet. Let's see, whatever name. And now, you can see we have a strand and a box here. So let's put, let's say a number, 19 and it automatically creates an attribute with the name of the tag and you can see current 19 right okay now let's go back to our text editor to create a button to roll that attribute so don't type equals roll and value Okay, and here you can write whatever thing you will use, you know, for rolling or a macros or whatever. And we use the attribute this way, this calling char strength. Okay, and then roll. Check and let's put it as TR button, closing button. Yeah, you save that and roll. Let's close this. Okay. You can see here it rolled 120 plus the strand uh, attribute, right? Yeah, and that's it. And as you can see, that's how you make a character sheet. You just need to know a little HTML. And then, of course, you will need to use CSS to do the decorations. Thank you very much for watching. I hope this was useful. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.